Welcome! Are you looking for the best kitchen gadgets? Great! Because we select for you the best kitchen gadgets on Amazon and AliExpress. These amazing kitchen gadgets will save you a lot of time. If you wanna buy any, just click on the description link. These gadgets will make you a real master chef. Enjoy the video and thanks for watching. Remove the included scoop and brush from the water tank. The brush can be used to clean your Nanopresso of any excess grounds that can build up over time. The water tank also has a cup attached to it. Next, unscrew the portafilter and remove the coffee filter basket. Add finely ground coffee into the scoop. Transfer the finely ground coffee from the scoop into the filter basket. Be sure to clean any grounds off the rim of the filter basket. The next step is to tamp the coffee using the bottom of the scoop as a tamper. There should be about four millimeters of space at the top of the filter basket after you tamp. To ensure proper grind size, use a scale to weigh eight grams of coffee. Next, put the coffee filter basket into the Nanopresso and screw on the portafilter. Make sure the portafilter is screwed on tight. Next, add boiling water to the water tank. Fill the water up to the line marked on the inside of the water tank. Screw the water tank onto the Nanopresso. Unlock the piston by twisting it counterclockwise. Flip the Nanopresso upside down and start pumping with slow, consistent pumps to build up pressure inside the machine. It should take about six to eight pumps to get up to pressure. After about 20 to 30 pumps, your espresso will be fully extracted. You will know the espresso is fully extracted once you no longer feel resistance in the piston. Once the espresso is fully extracted, the crema should be smooth and golden brown. 
Enjoy!
Thank you.